Hi. I always wanted to ask, how does it feel to be cancer? Yes, cancer. To make your mother sick, to be self-destruction, to the earth, to be human. And use being human as an excuse to be a murderer. We were cells of the same species, each original in mind, each having the understanding of natural morale, but within you, cells of our mother, the hunger for her death lay dormant. And soon awoke. No wonder we ourselves soon sought after our hosts, so we created boats and spread from the marrow of her earth to veins and seas, the current of a crimson river and breath of a breeze took us to various homes we were meant to take care of her. But as time passed, some cells sought after power. So instead of unified strength, we settled for the self-destruction of our mother. We became industrial. And in the industry, oil contributed to her lymph nodes swollen with our plastic and liver cramping to the viscous poison of our waste as we built factories like masses on her skin, large and inflamed to ooze smoke into her atmosphere, into her lungs. Now she can't breathe after all these years of smog. She's retaining heat. Oh God, no, her mother has a fever. Her ice caps are melting. She's cold sweating, drenched, flooding the surface of her skin, taking all those who sought after her death with her. She's shaking, quaking. Her skin is now gaping cracks of open wounds as she's coughing, bringing up lava and ash to gargle in disgust. Her breath is heavy now. And either way, too hot or too cold, churning into hurricanes coming after our homes. <laughs> you of little discipline fear your mother's death now? You of cancer, cold and sad story. You of well strength and pride, you of love. You of nothing but yourself, you, you, you can still change. Honor your mother regardless of how young she is in this universe, she's older than us all. Nurture her nature, show love to the rivers that course through her body, to seas that breathe life in death unknown, to skies that churn into thunder and lightning and bring life to beasts that roam the grassland. Show love to her. Design divine innovations to help you help your divine intoxicated mother. We were cancer, but now together we can be cure. Wow, yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all make some more noise for Jeremy. Jeremy was one of the six poets that represented Trinidad and Tobago at that Brave New Voices competition.